In this video tutorial, we're going to talk about using the new PQI380 or SDG200 file report tool. So let's get started. If you are not familiar with downloading PQI380 data or SDG200 data to a USB drive, please refer to the video in the bottom right hand corner. Once your PQI380 data or your SDG200 data is loaded on your USB drive, Open your browser and go to the Transtech Systems website, which is transtechsys.com. Click on the Products button, and from there, if you're using the SDG200, you want to go to the SDG200 page, click on Report Template. Once you do that, the Excel file will download, and you can import your data. If you're using the PQI380, click on the PQI380 button and then click on the report template. Once again, the template will download and from there you can import your data. Once the PQI report tool is downloaded to your desktop, open the file in Excel. Once the file opens, we want to import the PQI data file. So I'm going to press this button. Once the screen pops up, what I'm going to do is navigate to my USB drive and select that file. Once I select that file, it imports all the data, all the test numbers, the density, the compaction, surface temperatures, the date and time. If you entered that into the gauge while you were taking the readings, it would populate that data as well. You can also use the drop down menu to select from other categories. So there's things like test number, project name, location, contact, mix name, stone size, depth. These can all be set. That's how you use the PQI report tool. The SDG report tool is very similar. The only difference is the import button is going to say import MNT file, but all the processes are the same. 